Hello friends, good morning. It's another beautiful day. I hope you are feeling good this morning. I hope you're doing well. I'm going to come around so that I can see you and you can see me together. We're here and we are going to have another amazing adventure. Well, you might say, what are we going to do today, Miss Shannon? Well, if you have your supplies nearby and you can see my supplies, I have a cup of flour, I have some oil and a bucket, and we're going to make some moon dough. Moon dough. Have you ever heard of it? It's sort of like Play-Doh, but it's really fun to play with and it's loose. And we're going to allow our fingers to dig inside of it. We're going to make it together. So I'm so excited to start that with you. All right, friends, before we get started, I hope you're feeling great. Maybe a two thumbs up type of morning, right? How are we feeling? In the middle, not so well. Well, I hope those thumbs come up and you feel good by the time we are finished our time together. And I just want to give you a big squeeze, big, 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 squeeze. And I hope you will feel good soon if you're not. And if you're feeling great, I'm so happy. Let's get started. I'm going to grab my trusty purple pointer and we will begin. Good morning, boys and girls. Today is, let's look at the calendar. July 7th, 2021. And let's see what the number seven looks like. Here's number seven, right there. We'll put number seven in, on the board and we're going to spell July together and count from one to seven. Are you ready? I'm ready, let's begin. J-U-L-Y, it's the month of July. One, two, Three, four, five, six, and seven. We made it to seven days in the month of July, friends. Isn't that awesome? We're already through our first week, right? Our first one, two, three, four, five, six, seven days. And today is, what's today, friends? Did someone say Friday? No, Miss Shannon, it's not Friday. Today is Wednesday. Let's put Wednesday on the board and sing. Today is Wednesday, today is Wednesday. All day long, all day long. Today is Wednesday, today is Wednesday. All day long, all day long. Today is Wednesday. Happy, happy Wednesday. Happy, happy Wednesday. All right, friends, since we know that today is Wednesday, what was yesterday? Did we know? Did someone say Tuesday? If you said Tuesday, you are correct. Tuesday begins with the letter T and makes the T sound. Let's sing. Today is Wednesday. Yesterday was Tuesday. Today is Wednesday, yesterday was Tuesday. Today is Wednesday. All right, friends, if today is Wednesday and yesterday was Tuesday, what will tomorrow be? Will tomorrow be Thursday? If you said Thursday, you are correct. Let's spell Thursday together, friends. Are you ready? T H U. R-S-D-A-Y, Thursday. Let's put Thursday on the board. All right, friends, it's time to sing. Will you help me sing the days of the week? All right, let's clap. Days of the week, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week. There's Sunday and this Monday, there's Tuesday and this Wednesday, there's Thursday and this Friday, and then there's Saturday, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week. How many days are in a week? Did someone say there's seven? 
Yep, there's seven days in a week. And how many months are in a year? Did someone say 12? Yep, 12 months in a year. Are you guys ready to sing? I know you are. Help me, Shannon, help me sing. These are the months of the year. There's January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. These are the months of the year. All right, friends, we have 12 months in a year. And we are currently in what month, friends? What month are we in right now? Did someone say July? If you said July, you are correct. We're in the summer season right there. Summer begins with S. Can you guys say summer with me, Shannon? S -s summer when it's really hot outside. H-O-T, hot. The sun is shining. And where can we go? Can we go to the pool? Can we go to the beach and carry a beach ball like Mr. Dinosaur? Should we wear sunglasses in the summer, friends? Definitely. Could we wear a hat to protect our heads from the sun? Definitely. Can we wear short sleeve shirts? Could we or should we wear a coat? Which one, friends? Oh, we definitely don't have to wear a coat, right? Oh, it's just too hot for a coat. We have to wear our short sleeves or no sleeves at all. And should we wear long pants or short pants like Mr. Dinosaur? Did you say short pants? Yes, because it's warm. And in the summertime, we definitely want to dress light and cool so that our bodies stay cool and it doesn't get too hot for us, right? Okay, friends, it is time to sing. It's time to give each other a shout out because we made it today. Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Girls, you're up first. Let's rock and roll. R, R, R. My girls here today. My girls here today. I jump up, down, and all around. My girls are here today. Hooray. My girls made it today. Good job, girls. You are amazing. You have super dance moves. I love your moves. Keep it up. But you have to give the boys turn. If I have any boys here with me, I need you to stand up, boys, because it's your turn to dance. Are you ready? Are my boys here today? Are my boys here today? I jump up down and all around my boys are here today hooray my boys made it today all right friends now if you can help miss shannon i would love it okay are you ready ready miss shannon is miss shannon here today is miss shannon here today i jump up down and all around, Miss Shannon is here today. Hooray, Miss Shannon made it today. All right, friends, we made it together. I love when we all get to jump up and down and all around together. It's so much fun. All right, friends, let's sing a song about Mr. Sun. Do you remember our song? Oh, Mr. Sun. Sun, do you remember? And there's a sun right behind me. Can you see the sun? Before we sing, can you see that sun? Oh yeah, the sun is shining bright. We're going to sing. Are you ready? Let's pretend our fingers are the rays of the sun. And we're going to sing. Oh, Mr. Sun, Sun, Mr. Golden Sun, Please shine down on me. Oh, Mr. Sun, Sun, Mr. Golden Sun, hiding behind a tree. These little children are asking you.
So please come out so we can play with you. Oh, Mr. Sun, Sun, Mr. Golden Sun, please shine down on, please shine down on, please shine down on me. Did you guys like that? All right, now let's put our arms up, 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 high, 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 high as you can. Can you reach, 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 and bring them down low, low, low. Put your right arm up, up, up. 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 Down. Now the left arm. Put your left arm up. Up, 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 put your left arm up, 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 put your left arm up, 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 put your left arm up, up, up. You guys have the moves. Put it down and head, shoulders. What's next, friends? Knees and toes, knees and toes, head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes, eyes and ears and mouth and nose. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Friends, can we speed it up really fast? Like super, super, super duper fast. Can we do that together? Are you ready? One, two, three. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Eyes and ears and mouth and nose. Head, shoulders, head, shoulders, head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. <gasps> oh my goodness. That was so fast. Can we do it again? Can we do it even faster? Miss Shannon, I don't know if that's possible. Is that what you're saying? Let's see. Head, shoulders, knees, toes, knees, toes. Head, shoulders, knees, toes, knees, toes. Eyes and ears, eyes and ears, eyes and ears, and mouth and nose. Head, shoulders, head, shoulders, head, shoulders, head, shoulders, knees, toes, knees, toes. Woo! That was so fast. All right, friends, we should take a deep breath. Are you ready? Deep breath in. Deep breath out. Woo! Deep breath in, deep breath out. One more time, deep breath in, and deep breath out. Hands on your head, hands on your shoulders, hands on your elbows, hands on your tummy. Did you eat breakfast this morning? Hands on your ears, hands on your nose, hands on your chin, hands on your back. Can you reach your back? Can we do that? We can. Give yourself a big squeeze. For tennis, Miss Shannon, give you a big, 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 big squeeze. All right, take one more deep breath in. <sighs> And one out. Okay, friends, grab a drink of water if you need to, and we're going to get to our story. I needed water. That was some fast moving, right, friends? Woo! We moved super duper fast. That was fun. Okay, friends, guess what? Today is bonus book day. What does bonus book day mean? It means we get two books in one day. So sometimes we have a day where we just read one book, right? That's ordinarily we have one book that we read. But on bonus book day, we have two books that we read. And today we are going to read a book titled My Happy Day. Remember yesterday I shared with you friends that sometimes we experience different um, ways of how we feel, right? Sometimes we might be mad, we could get angry, or we could feel really happy, right? Or excited. So today we're going to talk about my happy day. How do we feel when we're happy, right? As we're playing, maybe we're playing with friends, or if you're playing with a cousin or a brother or a sister or someone that you're, you may be playing with, how do you feel sometimes? Let's see what happens in my happy day. could not wait for my mom to pick me up from school. I got my bag and everything as fast as I could. What's the hurry, Olivia? 
Mr. Tom asked. I'm going to my grandparents' house after school, I said. And mom said they have a big surprise. Here's your mom now, Mr. Tom said. Be sure to tell us about the surprise tomorrow. When we got to my grandparents' house, Mom told me to open the front door carefully. Before I could ask why, a puppy jumped on me. How exciting. Meet our new puppy, Lucky, said Grandpa. Watch out for dog kisses, said Nana. We should have named him Licky. We took Lucky outside and played with his squeaky toy. He ran silly circles around me. Sometimes he tripped over his own big paws. <laughs> we knew you would be so good with Lucky, said Nana. She gave me a hug. We hope you will come over and play with him whenever you want, said Grandpa. Of course I will exclaim, I exclaimed. We watched Lucky run around with his toy. Then Lucky got tired and he curled up in my lap for a nap. Best day ever, I whispered. I couldn't wait to tell everyone at school about my happy day. Look friends, what do you notice? What do you see? Do you see the girl and her face is really, really happy? She's smiling, she's super excited. Why do you think she's happy? Do you think she's happy because she has a dog? Do you see the dog? Do you see what color the dog is? What color is that dog? Yes, the dog is black and white, right? And what else do you notice? Is she hugging the dog? Mm hmm I think the dog is making her really, really happy, friends. And she's super excited about it. Yep. Friends, I wonder if this is her first time hugging the dog. Do you think it might be her very first time? Maybe she never hugged a dog before. That's a possibility, right? She could have never hugged a dog before, and this is her first time, so she's really, really happy. So that means every time that she goes to grandma and grandpa's, what's going to happen? She gets to visit the dog, right? Have you seen a dog before at your grandparents' house? Or maybe someone else's house, a friend's, or even your own, where you hugged your puppy or family's puppy? Yeah. All right, friends, that's the end. Up next is our second book, today's bonus book day, and it's titled, Let's Play. Good morning. What shall we do today? We could read a book. We could pick flowers. or go swimming, or play ball. We could climb a tree, or gather leaves, or play hide and seek. We could get some cheese. We could play dress up. Or talk on the telephone. All until it's time to say good night. <laughs> the end. Did you guys like the book? Did you think that the two friends that were playing together we're having a good time? I think so.
All right, friends, we are going to get to our exciting sensory play. Are you ready? We are going to use two ingredients, friends, just two. That means one, two, there are only two things that we need in order to make our mundo. So a moon we see in the sky at night, right? Similar to how we just saw in our book, but guess what? We get to make something called Mundo, and it's gonna be really, really fun. So I want you to grab your materials. I'm going to grab mine, and we're going to do this together. It's going to be really exciting. I can't wait, all right? I'm just gonna move a few of my things over. to back this up just a tad so you can see okay I'm gonna stand up and move my cart back that way you can follow along with Miss Shannon right we have two ingredients we have our bowl and we can use a mixing utensil like a fork or a spoon whatever you have it's totally okay i'm going to use my plastic bowl here i have about half of a dixie cup full of oil vegetable oil and i have flour and so we are going to take the flour and we're going to pour it in the bowl first okay so we have our plastic bowl here and we're just going to pour in our cup of flour. So it's one cup of flour. And we use this for baking, right? Flour is used for baking, friends. So if you wanted to bake or fry something, right? If you have seen your parents fry food, right? Or your grandparents cook, they use flour. So we're just going to shake it just a little bit, not too much. <laughs> We don't want to shake it a whole lot. I don't want it to get in my eyes, okay? Now, once we have our flour, we're going to add our vegetable oil, okay? So the vegetable oil, we're just going to pour it in, friends, okay? And just evenly pour it all around like that. Just like that, okay? So if you can see Miss Shannon, I just pour the oil right into my plastic bowl. And now I'm going to take my fork and I'm going to mix it, okay? So you can hold the bowl in one hand and mix with the other. Remember friends, we don't need a lot of vegetable oil just a little bit because once we mix it we want to make sure that there are pieces it seems like little pieces of rocks right or pieces of the moon <laughs> all right so we don't want that flour saturated heavy with vegetable oil just enough okay just enough. This is going to be so much fun because friends, once we finish mixing, we are going to, we're going to touch it with our hands. Ooh. But it's very important to mix it first, okay? Super important to get it mixed up really, really, really well. Okay, really good. I'm mixing mine up and it almost looks like crumbs, friends, or crust, like a pie crust. Kind of looks like that if we broke it up. <laughs> All right, so we're just gonna stir just a little bit more. Once we have it all stirred up, We are then going to touch it. 
All right, are you excited to touch the moon though and see what it feels like? How do you think it's going to feel? Do you think it's going to feel like Play-Doh maybe? All right, it's, it's mixed up pretty well for me. And it almost looks like sand too, friends. Like sand at the beach. Okay, are you ready? I'm going to dig in, let's see. Ooh, it definitely feels like sand. Ooh, look friends. Look at Miss Shannon's. Ooh, how does yours feel? Make sure you keep it over your bowl so it doesn't get all over the floor. <laughs> Does it feel like sand, friends? Look. How does yours feel? Right, it's a pretty light brown color, like a tan. Isn't the color beautiful? And it's so light. You can put your hands through it, right? You can dig underneath, dig, 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 dig. <laughs> and then it just falls right off your hands, right? You can mix it up. And if you feel like little clumps, all you have to do is press your fingers together and it'll just keep coming right out of your hands like pieces of sand. Right? Look what else we can do, friends. You can take your cup that had oil in it. And of course, the oil is not in there anymore because you used it while we were making the dough. You can scoop your cup with the sand. I'm going to call it sand. <laughs> but we call it moon dough, but you can call it sand as well. Look, friends, I'm going to pack it inside. It gets a little messy, but that's okay. When we have sensory play friends, it's fun to get messy, right? To get our fingers messy and our hands, totally okay. Friends, it's now upside down on my hand. What do you think is going to happen when I, happen when I pull it up? What do you think, friends? Let's see. Whoa, look friends, look friends, look, look what Miss Shannon made. Oh, I'm excited now. Look what I made, friends. How cool is that? Look, whoa, my own little sand castle. Look friends, right on my hand. And if you take it and you put it on your table, or maybe if you have a paper plate, you can do that as well, okay? I can't sit it on mine because friends, my tabletop has little, little circles all over it. And those circles are open. So that sand is gonna fall right through Miss Shannon's station, right? So I just did it in my hand. Wasn't that cool, friends? Ooh, and look, if I do it again, scoop it right in there like that. And if I push it down, Push it all the way down like that. And I put it in this hand. I'm gonna do the same thing. Oh yes, the same thing again. Ooh, so cool, right? And if you have a spoon or your, or your um, utensil, you can just pick it up like this and place it in your cup, right? You can scoop or pick it up, almost like a shovel. Doesn't this look like sand, friends? <laughs> Definitely. And we can play with this all day. This is another great activity to play with outside, friends, for sure. A great, great, great outdoor activity. Yeah, and then when you take it and dump it out, we can go up, 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 as long as we stay over, whoop! Did you guys see that come out? All right. And if you want, take your fork or spoon and keep digging out all the excess sand that's left in your cup. This was so much fun, right friends? And friends, you can leave it in a plastic Ziploc bag or you can leave it in a plastic container if it has a top. Right, and you can play with it as much as you want. Isn't that so much fun? You can get some seashells, 
and pretend you're at the beach, right? And you can play with it, put it in between your fingers, right? It feels so light. All right, friends, I really hope you enjoyed this activity with me. I really enjoyed it with you and I had a great time. I'll see you right back here tomorrow and we're going to paint, okay? Remember, you are awesome, you are intelligent, and you are amazing. Happy Sensory Play Day. Bye, friends.